on this slide we can recognize part of the adrenal cortex associated with summer mass. On the higher magnification we can differentiate zona glomerulosa uh, near the surface and zona fasciculata which is composed of these slightly lighter more voluminous cells and uh, deeper zona reticularis. Now pay uh, let's pay attention to this mass here. It is composed of predominant stroma which consists of uh, spindle shaped cells arranged in the fascicular pattern. These cells have elongated thin nuclei, some of them are wavy, they have pointed ends. Some of the cells uh, look like Schwann cells. This stroma can uh, resemble neurofibroma. And the second component is formed by these mature ganglion cells. They have a slightly basophilic voluminous cytoplasm and this centrally located bland nucleus. The similar ganglion cells are also here, here and here. The stroma can have sometimes like myxoid appearance, at least focally, as here, for example. This is the typical morphology of a ganglioneuroma. It is a mature benign neoplasm that originates from the neurocrest cells, either of the sympathetic ganglia or of the adrenal medulla. So we can find it usually in the retroperitoneum or less commonly in the adrenal gland, as in this case. It is part of the spectrum of neuroblastic tumors, with the neuroblastoma being the poorly differentiated malignant tumor, the ganglioneuroblastoma with intermediate differentiation, and this ganglioneuroma is the most differentiated and well differentiated benign tumor. Thanks for watching.